Hello everybody, it's your boy Dubar, and welcome back to another episode of Luigi's Mansion for the Nintendo GameCube. Last episode, we started off the game and we entered the spoopy, stoopy, spooky mansion for the very first time. We fought a couple ghosts and we saved two toads. Now, in the day, we're going to uh, we're gonna head up to floor two to do the first area because in this game there are four areas. This is the first. Right up here, and the door that we don't. Uh, what's this? What's this? this? Hold up a sec, Luigi. It's me, Professor E. Yeah, I didn't expect stronger than we see there in the head. I think it must be some of those escaped gallery ghosts. You know that they're really different from the other ghosts you've seen so far. They don't show their hearts really easily. Nope, not at all. When you find one, you should you first use the X button to search his heart for clues. Sometimes you can learn the best way to surprise him. Well, Luigi, I keep my fingers crossed for you. All right. Keep that in mind for later. So, um, here's a little bit of a fun fact about this entire episode. Um, when I played, when I recorded episode 2, because originally episode 2 was going to come out a lot earlier than tonight. Um, when I recorded it, for some reason, the capture got corrupted. So, I tried all the stuff in my power to, like, see if I could, like, revive it, but nothing was working. So at this point, so at this point, I just gave up on that and just decided to record. So um, you might wonder how did I get the save file for this? I didn't. I just restarted at a different save file and just made it to this part. That's basically what I did. Hopefully the hopefully the audio does not get corrupted. Hopefully it doesn't get corrupted. So um, yeah, that being said, let's enter room area one. Hmm. We've already seen this cutscene many different times. All right. For the duration of Area 1, this is mostly the duration of Area 1, uh, what we're going to do is, we're this door is the only one that's open, but for the duration of Area 1, until we beat the boss of Area 1, this entire room is going to be closed, like nothing inside, and for some reason there are rat ghosts, despite the fact rats are kind of dead already. Alright, we enter this room, maybe one of this room looks different, shut up Luigi. Welcome to the study. It's a really interesting. What the fuck is this book doing? I'm gonna suck this book up. And you may be wondering, what's that rocket chair doing? What's it doing? Good question. <gasps> it's right here. And if we press L on my Switch Pro Controller, there he is. The very first portrait ghost of Luigi's Mansion. Like, like this isn't like no choice of art. This is actually the very first portrait ghost you unlock, like gameplay wise. Unless you buy it, unless you got a save file from the I mean, yeah, that this is the first portrait ghost you get. So um, let's do what you guys says. We gotta read. You might notice there's a little heart right there. We're gonna scan it with the with the Game Boy Horror. Let's see. Ho ho ho! Go ahead, try to find me. I can see you, but you cannot see me. Ho ho ho! Exactly. We can't, we can't see him unless we shine. Mario. Unless we shine, if we don't, if we don't look at him, he'll be do that. He'll just stand right there, like that. That's Neville. This is Neville, the very first portrait ghost in Luigi's Mansion. As you see, he's reading himself a little book. But if you notice, when he was yawning, his heart was revealed. This is how we capture him. As soon as he yawns, we're gonna capture him. There you go. See, as you can probably guess, that portrait ghosts have their own theme. I'm pretty sure this is one of the few reasons why um, my audio got corrupted. Oh god, there's a rotten mushroom. Because when I was recording this, it, this, this part when you suck up the ghost, it lagged like hell. It lagged so much, which probably was the main reason why it lagged so much. But um, it doesn't lag anymore because I messed with the settings on Dawson Emulator. And now we good here. It's nothing. It was nothing to do with my with the OBS. I'm pretty sure if there was, if it was, I had to do something about it. But um, right now we have by defeating more Navelle, we've unlocked the chest. Oh, yeah. Put that, put that dick in there, Luigi. Uh -huh. I don't know why Luigi screws with the chest though. It doesn't make sense. Now that we've unlocked the the key to the study, we can now move on to the next room. Mm -hmm. To find the next portrait ghost. Oh shit, this is actually terrifying. Oh, oh suck this, suck it, suck it. There you go. Dead. Sucky, sucky, sucky. 
Alright, sucky sucky. Alright, we're gonna go all the way over here because this is where the key goes to. I guess if you like use the keys in the wrong room, the game gets soft locked. Something. I don't know, this is like some linear bullshit. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Alright. We are now. Alright, we are now here. Alright. Welcome to the master bedroom. Before we do anything, we're gonna. And as you can see, this. Here we have another portrait ghost. This is Lydia. This is Navelle's wife. We are in Navelle. We captured him earlier. Pretty sure. So, before we do anything, we're gonna scan her. Scan her with the game. What the fuck was I doing? We're gonna scan her with the Game Boy Horror. That's what she says. Isn't my hair just gorgeous? Of course I do spend a lot of time on that. I was so bold, coped up in that painting. Now I spend all my time in front of the mirror. It seems to scare people though. So everything comes up with, coming up with roses. Despite you guys saying that we need to scan up with the Game Boy Horror for some clues. These are not really wise clues though. But what we have to do is we're going to yank on this thing right here. Let's see this window right here. And then now... And you, oh, tears. and now we're gonna suck you, suck you like a suck abyss. Get in my vacuum cleaner, die. She's even like, trying to attack it. Oh god, right, mushroom. Suck you in, get get you in my vacuum cleaner. And now you're in my vacuum cleaner. And we got another treasure chest. And you may notice there is a big hole in the window, and there's a toad out there. That's the same toad that we found last episode. Let's put our deck in that thing again. And we got another key. Right, let's see where this key leads us. Alright, the key leads to right there. Right there in the next room below. Mario! Mario! Shut up, Luigi. Um, however, if we do... However, one thing we can do, on the other hand, is if we do that, we should get like a shit ton of money. Oh, there you are. Get a lot of money in return, but not as much to, um, get something. But I played this before. Hey, when I played this, um, on my original recording, I got a gem out of this. Uh-oh. At least, not do that. Alright, let's see what's over here. Hmm. What? What the hell? What is in there? Oh well, it doesn't matter. So, we must enter this room. Because this is the room where we're supposed to go. Got a key, and let's open it. And as you can see, we're in some sort of baby's room. Welcome to the nursery. You probably will- I'm pretty sure you'd probably know what ghost is gonna be inside this po what poultry ghost is gonna be inside there. It's a baby. It's a baby ghost. we are scan him. we are scan him. Scan him right there. It says, Hoshi, Waki. Hoshi. Yeah. This is Chauncey, the spoiled baby. Out of every single character, Chauncey is the only character that I know his description of. So, um, yeah, by the time of him, oh, yeah, he's really spoiled. He's a little piece of shit. He's a piece of shit, basically. What is this? Is that supposed to be Chauncey before he died? Oh, yeah, everyone who resides in this mansion, Navelle and Lydia, they probably died. Weird. One of the most interesting things is that in the, um, in the, uh, what room was it? Hold up. Can you go, can you look into the different rooms? No, you can't. Um, and that main room where we found Egad for the first time, there were a bunch of portraits on the walls. Those are meant to represent the, uh, the, the ghosts, and, um, Nivelle and Lydia's portraits were on there, so, let's see a nudge. Chauncey looks a lot better, but, well, alright, back to the game. What we're supposed to do is we're supposed to rock the little host seat. And as you see, the door is locked, so we can't get out of here. Uh -oh. Hey, wanna play with me? And by that, he he wants to kill you. So what we're going to do is we're going to... Oh god, teddy bears are going to... Teddy bears. Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to whack you in the face. Haha. -ha. You've been whacked. You've been whacked. Ow. You gave me an owie. I 
just wanted to play with you. I hate grown ups. Why do you have to be so big old than me? I've had enough. Oh, no, go smaller. So easy to be little weak. Gotta go back. What does that mean? Oh. Oh, shit. What the hell? What the hell? Luigi having that same baby looking scream? Oh well, at least we all know who the true crybaby of this game is, and it ain't Chauncey. So yeah, episode 2, oh, what the fuck? So yeah, episode 2, we're already in the very first boss of the game. Ow, shit. So yeah, for some reason they decided to make the baby the boss of this area. This is the first floor boss, by the way. I don't know why they did that, but it's stupid, but uh, what we're supposed to do is, you know these balls right here, remember what these balls did Chauncey? What we're gonna do is we're gonna suck these and we're gonna whack them in the face like we did before, and we're gonna suck you up. Suck you up. Suck you up. You can go into the fire pits of hell like your mother and father. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Ow. Ass. Yeah, no. Please never do that again. Now when Chauncey's gonna do that, he's gonna keep bossing around a little shit. Oh god. No. Please stop doing that. That is like the most cursed thing. And the fact that you have that the pacifier in your mouth doesn't even fall into your mouth makes zero sense. Like you should be choking right now. Also, you double die. Alright, we have more balls. Balls to the wall. Oh shit. Ow, fuck. Alright, you've been executed and now you're coming into my vacuum cleaner where you will die. Alright, he's almost dead. Alright, he's at 10%. Now we gotta kill him. Shut the hell up, you stupid baby. You're so fucking annoying. Piece of shit, you little turd. Dick. I can name like everything Chauncey is right now, and I'm pretty sure 90% of the people are gonna agree with me. Oh shit, oh shit, shit, shit. Alright, there. Alright. Wham, and that's one last time, come on, one last time, and you are dead, and now you're dead, we won, we beat the boss, and we screwed Chance, now Chance is gonna be in the fiery pits of hell along with his mother and father, anyways, by defeating Chauncey, we got ourselves a treasure chest, and unlike the rest of the treasure chest, this one feels really sizable for Luigi's giant cock. Luigi, stick it in there. You deserve it. Oh, yeah. Oh. I always thought it was like a normal key. This is fine, though. <laughs> we did it. We got the key. The pink key. The Barbie key. Luigi. <laughs> hmm? All right, what do we want you got? Luigi, can you hear me? Oh, thank goodness you're okay. I lost contact with you of all of a sudden. I was a tad worried. That's because I was transported into the baby's crib. <clears throat> you seem to be tuck a bit tuckered out after that long uh, battle, don't you? Well, why don't you come back to the lab? When you vacuum a goss ghost, your pulse of that 3000 gets pretty much full to burst. But ho oh, ho I guess you showed that boss ghost who's boss. That's hmm. not really... Okay, but okay, we're back to, it's back to the lab. Good job, Luigi. You made it back in one piece. Take a get into this. This funny piece of work near, took nearly 20 years to develop. I call it the ghost for portrait the fucking lying lies or what the fuck is that? This machine let us turn the ghost to catch into paintings. Not only that, it works in reverse too. Really convenient. Hmm? How do we use it, you ask? Well, it's simple. Just plug the poltergeist 3000 into that slot and enjoy the ride, my boy. This piece is what all true warriors strive for. Well. I just wonder what King Boo's up to. Oh, yeah. 
Anyways, those three ghost spirits are just gonna chill because we only caught three portrait ghosts in area one. Hopefully in area two and three and four we can be able to catch a lot of them. Alright. Alright, we got one of them. The ghosts are invisible. So what we need to press them in invisible forms. Interesting. And presto. Turn them into beautiful ghost portraits. Interesting. And now we got portraits of the three of the get of a family. Hmm. Well, we managed to turn those ghosts back into paintings. Thanks for your help, Luigi. All right, we did good. All right. Now you've caught. All right, we got Navelle. Pretty simple. We got Lydia. Dun doll. And we got Chauncey. Dun 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 dun. This is actually pretty catchy. But yeah, once you beat er a certain area, you get results of every portrait ghost you've captured. And I caught three ghosts. So that's not really good. Got all this stuff. All this pointless stuff. I don't really think we need all that, but okay. Damn, that much. And then that's four million five hundred forty-five million dollars. Thousand dollars. That's a lot of money. All right, let's save. Anyways, I'm Dubar, and this has been Luigi's Mansion.